friends, it's Jacqueline here. In today's video, I will be sharing with you five products that beauty YouTubers made me buy it. Are they a yay or a nay? And this video is in collaboration with a beautiful creator here in YouTube. Her name is Estefania Messina. If you haven't watched her videos, you are missing out. She's a great content creator. She does excellent reviews, very detailed with a lot of comparisons. She's a sweetheart and well, she has a part of me that obviously I'm disconnected because she is Italian and you know my love for Italian people. My husband is Italian, I repeat it a million times. And I came across to her channel looking for a review of a specific eyeshadow palette and wait until you see her. Her eyes, I have this thing with blue eyes, okay? Don't get me wrong, but, but her eyes, yes. I always have to talk about these. Her eyes are mesmerizing. And, but the thing that kept me in and made me subscribe to her channel is how honest she came across, the way that she did many comparisons with other items and that she's not afraid to actually tell you right on your face Eh, you don't need it you know you don't need this thing and you know just move on and she has this love for makeup i mean she has a really big collection so she has a lot of knowledge and looking back to her older videos and i'm telling you looking back back last year when i was like looking into her channel and see she is a bodybuilder OMG, she does have videos if you like fitness and you're into bodybuilder or just simply, you know, like get up and, you know, get fitted, you should check because she, you know, it's a double whammy right there. I mean, she's a professional trainer that you can get so much like, you know, goodness from, from past videos of hers. And she has posted a few other videos also as we are staying at home on her fitness routine. To me, her content is so valuable in many, many aspects from the fitness area and her love for beauty. And if you're coming from Estefania's channel, welcome. Thank you so much for your time, for stopping by. I'm so glad you're here and I hope that you want to stick around. If you do so, you know the real right, just subscribe to my channel. Also, do not forget to ring the bell so you don't miss any of my content. I also have a great Instagram. If you want to follow me there, that would be amazing. And now let's get it started with these five products that beauty gurus made me buy. Starting with the first product, and this is a beauty product. To me, a skincare product and the perhaps the only product on the market or one of the only products that really have shown to actually do something for your skin. And we're talking about aging right here. And it is the Tinted Elta ND UV Elements Moisturizing Physical Sunscreen. Yes, it is sunscreen. And if you are 20, 25 years old, 30, early 30s, I'm already, I have already a step in the fourth floor. Let me tell you, we are all going to age. And I have been, that woman that on my early teen years, I live in Peru, I'm Peruvian by the way, and I live one block away from the beach. So let me tell you that every single day, every single day that there was sun, I was going at the beach, laying down, no sunscreen, no SPF, and just like put myself like pour myself in oil. That's what I used to do all the time. And I didn't know what was the damage that I was causing to my skin. But again, to me, SPF is a thing that it really will help if you don't want to see the signs of aging all, you know, like overtaking and overwhelming you. Start with your SPF. This is a savior. But this product in particular was recommended by Angie from Hot and Flashy, and she is not your typical beauty guru. I mean, she keeps it real. She tries things for a prolonged amount of time. Even when she does reviews on foundation, she will show you like day by day, like, you know, in different scenarios, different weather. I mean, like she does really in-depth reviews. And I have learned that although we have very different skin type and she has obviously 
from all these trials that she has done with the skincare, she has developed a certain resistance to certain products. But I think that something that we really have in common is this product right here. And I'm so grateful to Angie to actually show this product because yes don't get me wrong i i can even do an entire video of products that they don't work from angie and from other youtubers that i'm going to share right here but this one right here feels nice moisturizing it, it actually even sell your skin tone because it does have a tint it just looks so beautiful on the skin effortless and I do have sensitive skin and this doesn't break me out. Actually, my kids use it too. Obviously, it doesn't give you any white cast. And we are going into summer months and things will become normal again. This sunscreen right here is water resistant. So this is a plus, 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 plus for me. And I will buy it with my eyes closed, whether it's full price, if I get a discount, oh yeah, even better. But yes, this is definitely a yay on my list. Next product right here, it's a foundation. And I think this is an OG for many, many people. And actually, I heard about this foundation, again, from many people. But the person that really actually pushed me in and like, I felt like, okay, this is the product that you need to try was Alana Davison and she is a Canadian YouTuber. She, I mean, like, I love her content. She's very fresh, silly, happy. I don't know. I just like her ways, her takes and she's sometimes even quirky and I love that. She's very, very natural and she, I mean, pretty much everything that she recommends for me, it's a hit. I mean, like, I cannot really think about anything that she has recommended that I will say is a miss. But anyhow, going back on to that foundation, it is the Giorgio Armani Luminous Silk Foundation. And I'm wearing it right now. It just gives a very subtle, nice luminosity. It's very lightweight on the skin. It, I mean, if you have signs of aging, it's not going to emphasize say your fine lines also if you have enlarged pores too it's very forgiving on your large pores it does cost you know a pretty penny 64 dollars but to me it's completely worth it maybe one of the most forgiving type of foundations that it actually makes your skin look youthful it's not so heavy that it looks too makeupy and it's just beautiful all in all just lovely and definitely a foundation that if you have dry skin it's just gonna be one of your best friends and it actually it's kind of like long wearing i will say a solid eight hours and your skin will still look really beautiful and even when it fades off it doesn't wear off like in patches or you know like in an odd way it's just absolutely stunning this foundation going into another product that actually I bought it before I discovered Andrea Ali's channel. She's a makeup artist. She's based in France. I think she's Romanian, if I don't mistaken. If I'm mistaken, please leave it in the comments below. But she is just a true talent. I love her energy. She's she's a little sparkle here in YouTube and her take on makeup. Also, I mean, her videos are professionally done. I think her husband, he's a professional photographer and I mean, on that side, he has a lot of experience with filming. But okay, going back to the product right here. I bought it. I don't even remember why or when. I mean, I have been always you know, in love with Tom Ford products. So I bought it, but I wasn't really getting used out of it until I kept watching Andrea and she just kept bringing this product up. And I'm like, you know what? Let me just dig in. And she is right. She's right. I mean, and this product also, if we're going back to Alana Davison, she also loves it, is the Tom Ford Shade and Illuminate in Intensity 1. Well, that's particular in my shade, but what I like about it is that this is a contour but slash bronzer this is for the person if you don't like to really contour and you like to have like a bronze tour type of thing and that type of result and you know have a seamless application this product right here will not move your foundation it's very easy to blend you have great pigmentation and you just need a little a little amount and you will go like oof 
a long long way and it just gives this very seamless type of bronze that is just perfection i just absolutely love it i have used it so so much and believe me to even recommend these products sometimes i go like i'm a luxury makeup lover i do have a lot of luxury products on this channel here but with this one i have such a great confidence to say if you're going to spend something on tom ford and you like to use bronzer these don't let it go just go ahead you're gonna love it and not only the bronzer also the highlighter although a lot of people don't talk too much about the highlighter but this right here also will illuminate your face just giving you mostly of like a glass skin type of glow oh divine this is truly divine the next product was recommended by Kathleen lights and i mean she has had many collaborations with the brand colourpop but honestly all of her collaboration has been beautiful, but one thing that I actually take from her that she recommend that I think is like truly a beautiful highlighter is the Super Chalk Highlighter, again, Colourpop in the shade Flexitarian. I have it right here, Swatch. It's not only a beaming highlighter, but a very easy highlighter, mostly for people that have, we have like texture and we have dry skin or we have already our fine lines and you still want to be highlighted, but you know, do not emphasize those imperfections. I think this product right here is very forgiving because of the formulation, the super, the <laughs> super, no, the super shock formulation is something that you can build up that you can blend in it doesn't lift the foundation up either and it just looks so natural and in fact i do not have highlighter right now i mean you can just apply it with your fingers and look at that mm -hmm, it looks so good and like i said because it's not powder and it has this kind of like cream to powder bouncy formula it actually blends in the skin super easy and this product is actually the one that brought me that little spark of curiosity in the brand Colourpop it, it was because Kathleen Lights yeah I love it I mean it looks like your skin is wet I think it looks so pretty so natural so like a skin like you know like you can see like on your hand like beaming but when it goes into the skin it looks so pretty and it looks I mean, I shouldn't say a highlighter is natural, but it's as natural as it gets in the sense of that glass skin glow without leaving a white cast. And the price is unbeatable. I mean, like, I'm here holding Tom Ford and on the other side, Colourpop. But if you're a beauty lover, I mean, it really doesn't matter much the price. I mean, I know buying something luxurious, I, I have a lot of luxury products and it feels like you know it makes you feel like oh it, this is so special i'm pampering myself but there's other products out there that they don't have that big price tag and they still perform really really well and diving into my last product right here it's something that actually tati westbrook she recommended uh i think she had it on was 2018 favorites of the year i think don't quote me on that but it's from l'oreal It's the gold addiction lipsticks color rich in the shade nude gold 950 and it's a shade that i'm wearing right now i have a golden undertone and i love bronzy tones on my skin whether it's bronzer and whether it's eyeshadows but mostly on my lips and it doesn't go patchy it looks creamy it's moisturizing i mean like it feels nourishing and hydrating to your lips being comfortable and then it does have this sheen that for some people may be like oh this is a little bit too metallic but it's not metallic at all i mean like it just looks so beautiful again if you have warm undertones you will love this particular shade 950 there's other shades also on the line that i really like but 950 is kind of like for me one of the best ones and i know i have shared with you five products and they have been all yays honestly i didn't want to bring too much kind of like the negative tone because of the current situation but let me just give you perhaps one bonus item yeah one bonus thing right here 
Desi Perkins, I love Desi Perkins. She has Latin roots like myself and Peruvian. And I love absolutely everything that she does, what she wears, her tutorials. I think I have taken, I have absorbed so much of what she has done and you know like actually share with us but one product that i really hated it and i was going blind into buy it and it's something very cheap too well not super cheap but you know is the costco kirkland uh, makeup wipe removers Ugh. if you have sensitive skin stay far 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 away from it you're not gonna like it at all it's it's just, it makes my skin super dry, super itchy, it breaks me out, and I had it, I mean, you know how it's Costco, you buy, you know, a full long box with so many of them. Oh Lord, that was the worst mistake. I had it for perhaps a full long year. I ended up using it for, you know, removing just my swatches. Also, I don't, I don't use makeup removing wipes anymore you know i stopped to doing that like eight months ago but yeah that was perhaps the worst recommendation right there and the worst purchase that i have done and now it is your turn to share with me what products have you purchased from recommendations of big beauty youtubers i would love to know if they were a yay or a nay let's start the conversation in the comment section below and while you're at it i hope that you will consider subscribe to my channel ring the post notification bell believe me you don't want to miss any any of my content also come and follow me on my instagram and please do not forget go share some love and some support to stefania thank you so much stefania for this collaboration it means a lot to me if you like this video do not forget to give it a thumbs up also share with family and friends and until the next time i hope you have a beautiful wonderful day